Another jab. Oh, oh, one, two. Oh, oh, that was Allen. Strickland this trying to it. end it. That's and it does. Sean Strickland. Sean Strickland is a controversial figure in the MMA world, but there's no doubting this fighter's talent. Strickland got his start in the UFC in 2014 when he faced Bubba McDaniel at UFC 171. He wasted no time making a huge statement. Oh, there he, now he's teeing up shots. Bubba. Yeah. Bubba's in great Trouble. position. Those are hard punches, Mike. Oh, another one. Yeah, he He's is, caught him in that same spot about five times. He's fighting angry, Mike. And I mean that in a good way. Right. Wants to make a statement yeah. in his UFC debut. Kimura possibility on the left arm of Bubba. He's looking for it. He wants to pin that arm down. He wants to, he's going to step over. Okay, much better now. Good job. In, in trying to go after that hand, he gave up an opening for the, look at this. Beautiful job taking the back. Very nicely done. Bubba is in all sorts of trouble. Wow. 30 right seconds. Under the chin. Trying to finish That's it. it. That That's is all it. over. Beautiful Sean job. Sean Strickland lives up to the hype and then some. In the very first round, Strickland scored a submission victory by rear naked choke and put the whole middleweight division on notice. Not many UFC fighters make a debut like this. After decision victories against Luke Barnett and Igor Araujo, Strickland would face Alex Garcia at UFC Fight Night. This is where Strickland would score his first knockout finish in the UFC. Trying to stuff Strickland up against the fence. We'll see if we're going to get a takedown attempt from Garcia here. And there it is, and easily defended by Sean Strickland. And goes right back to work in that jab. Garcia may be hurt here. Looks a little wobbly on those legs, and he is. Sean Strickland now searching for the finish. Garcia's hurt bad. Strickland, oh, Garcia's it. down! Sean Strickland with a massive KO! In the third round, Strickland found a home for his punches and knocked Garcia to the mat. It was a great performance where Strickland proved the power of fighting behind the jab. Another great Strickland finish came when he faced Nordin Taleb at UFC Fight Night and scored a TKO victory. This was the last fight on Strickland's UFC contract at the time, so he was sure to end it in spectacular fashion. Together the combinations halfway through the second round. Dean Taleb is hurt and he is hurt bad. He does not have his wits oh, about him. Big right now. This. And another one. Taleb is this. buckled and down on his back. This has got to be the finish. Taleb's trying to reach up and control, but he doesn't have a close guard. He's taking big shots from a standing position. And look how Strickland's not letting him close his guard. He's keeping his hips back enough so he can sit up and land big punches. Just like that. Oh, big right direct. That was a big shot to the chin. No need to left. I'm not sure his heads are completely clear. He's taking some of these shots here. Another oh, one as Strickland goes down, and that's it. A big right from Strickland rocked to lead, and from there he followed up with brutal strikes that eventually forced the ref to stop the fight. Fights like this are why we're always watching Sean Strickland. Strickland would earn his first performance of the night bonus over two years after his TKO on Taleb. Sean had been in a motorcycle accident that put the fighter out of commission until 2020. After a decision victory against Marshman, Strickland faced Brendan Allen at UFC Fight Night and made a huge comeback. Another jab. Oh. One, two. Oh, that that was was Allen. Strickland trying to end it. it. That's and it does. Sean Strickland. Wow. In round two, Strickland landed a one-two combo that rocked Allen and forced the ref to step in. This scored Strickland his first performance of the night bonus and proved he was still UFC caliber. Finally, Sean Strickland would face one of the UFC's fiercest fighters when he went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Uriah Hall at UFC Fight Night. Hall was famous for a spinning back kick that remains one of the Ultimate Fighter's greatest knockouts. But Strickland put on a masterclass and handled the technical striker with ease. I'm sure you end the combination with authority. Oh, Strickland's starting to put it together. Oh, 
Falls back against the fence, and Strickland getting busier. At middleweight in the UFC for Sean Strickland, but he's starting. Oh! Whoa. He's hurt, he's hurt. Heavy There's takedown, something something's yeah, up to Ryan Hall, who's covering up. Uh, this is Can he survive the end? Sean Strickland is hammering. Get to the fence. He's talking to him, saying, stand up, get to the fence. Wow, that was a close one for Uriah Hall. Yeah. Oh, oh, heavy shot hurt. from Strickland. He's going to put it on him. Oh, he's wobbled oh, along the fence oh, now. Strickland started to unload. Ah, goes in for a takedown. Smart move there from Strickland, though. Hall had little answers for Strickland's pressure, and in the end, Sean came out with the win by unanimous decision. Is there a Sean Strickland moment we missed? Let us know in the comments. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe and check back every week for more Ultimate MMA.